Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, this is Whoopi speaking. I am tonight speaking of something very simple. As I showed in the previous video, I work on this motor and I try to get the shorting coil of this air coil. And after some readings in some books, I learned that the air coil is perhaps not the best way to get a strong flyback because I have no core and so no storing energy in the core. Advantage of this air core is uh, no cogging, especially, but perhaps not the best one to get the most flyback spike. And I get out of my drawers here something old already that works very well and I wanted to check the what Romero UK made it is if we can get some uh, energy back from this uh, shorting coil so you have seen here this is the rotor this is six pole rotor all same pole okay this is a uh, microwave oven fan motor cut in two and as you can see there's a very strong inductor induction 1.5 Henry for 208 ohm coil and it works with these two poles here so there's almost no cogging effect, very very light. The beep 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 is only the red switch. So there is here the red switch to short the coil. But without shorting the coil, I have a lead here. I will turn by hand, no electronics, no battery, nothing all around. Okay, so if I turn the rotor with some speed, the lead is coming on which is normal, but after some time, when the speed goes down, the lead goes down. Okay. Now I have this red switch here, and I have these small legs here. I will short, tuck the coil here, and see what happens. Okay, so I redo what I did before. The lead is coming on, the speed is going down, so the lead is going slightly out, it is out, and now I short, look, I short, I short, I short, and very low speed it works, almost until stop, incredible. Redo it, no speed, no change to light the lead. But now up, I short, and the lead Yeah, there is something to look at this. Okay, for just for the info, and hope this helps. Good night at all.